That was another Diamond Rio tune, our classic country hits artist of the morning with wrinkles. <laughs> and uh, you're hanging out here with Brian and Chris. You asked me, or you kind of told me a little while ago, you thought my wrinkle cream was working well. Yeah, and then your air drums and all, that was real nice. I like that song right there. In fact, I'm going to play a couple of more of my favorite Diamond Rio tunes, <laughs> but i got to get ready, you know. I'll be heading over to, uh, to Sugar Grove later today, to mention our, our, uh, our day. Kelly. I almost called him R.K. Relly. But, uh, I'm as bad with names as you are with numbers this morning. Yeah, I'm having a rough time. So, uh, anyway, we're going to be there for the show tonight there at the Naval Base in Sugar Grove. Hope you come and join us. It's a free show. How often do you get to see, you know, one of the top acts there that's out real bit big in country music out there? I'm about 14, 15 years they've been out on the scene. Come on out and see a free show from them at Naval Base tonight. A nice free concert and what's better to do? Huh. Sitting around in the studio pretty fun this morning. Oh, yeah. And I actually let you dig through some stuff. I, I get emails galore, like hundreds and hundreds a day. And uh, one of the emails I got yesterday, I saved for you because I thought you might enjoy this. Uh, of course, most folks enjoying the summer so far. But according to the website guyism.com, and I seem to find lots of stuff there, there are some bad things about summer. And this is the, uh, of course, according to the guys, things they don't like about summer. And the first thing, and this is one thing that you've already told me about ten times this morning, you don't like about summer are bugs. Yeah, okay. Whether it's gnats, mosquitoes, ticks, or chiggers, bugs are often all your tasty flesh. <laughs> and I'm not a big fan of the ants or the spiders either, so I'm just right. going to throw that in there. Yeah, that, that was two of the things you didn't you told me earlier. I am didn't like. scared of spiders. <laughs> You didn't have to tell everybody. Well, no one out there is really going to hunt me down and kill me with spider. Yeah. <laughs> Hold a spider up to your face or something like that. Yeah. Also, number two, we got the top five things, I guess, that are uh, the guys don't like about the summer. Number two is heat. From garbage on the street to sweaty dudes all around you, summer can be cruel to your nose. <laughs> Studio, it can get kind of sweaty. And yeah, I'm starting to smell it over here, especially since you took your shoes off. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> I told you I'm trying to be comfortable just like you are. You got your feet propped up over there. Also, of course, being out there in the sun, especially as hot as it's been lately, a lot of folks fighting sunburns. You know you're in trouble when it hurts to take a shower. I hate that. That's an awful feeling. I don't get sunburns. I tan. I've done really well this year, but <laughs> when I cleaned out when I had to get my new car a few weeks ago, yeah. I found, because everywhere I go, you know, I tried to always keep Dalton from getting burnt, so we won't do a game. Or so I'm guessing you shot through your old sunscreen? I found, I, well, I found like four bottles of sunscreen <laughs> in the car, so I've been, been using that. And actually, I got a rather nice tan, which normally, normally I don't have any sun. Usually you're pale and red. <laughs> but not too bad this year. Also, the fact that television isn't as good there in the summertime either. You always have crappy television because the networks stick with the reruns and horrible reality shows. Maybe they actually want us to go outside and play. Man, there you go. That could be part of it. Yeah. If, it weren't, if it weren't for sports, my TV wouldn't be on at all, I don't think. Neither would mine, other than a few shows I actually do watch. And sometimes crowds can be a problem there in the summers, too. Guess what? You're not the only one who thought it was a good day to go to the beach or the amusement park. <laughs> and now you have to sit in traffic and wait in long lines. I'm not fond of traffic. I'm not fond of many other people. <laughs> Except for me. Yeah, yeah. So anyway, that's according to guyism.com, the top five things guys don't like about the summertime. I agree with them. Yeah, most of them fall into the all right category. I, I mentioned I had a phone call a few minutes ago. I want to say hi to Elva Campbell. She uh, called in. and I believe her and her husband have been celebrating a birthday. I think it's only tomorrow. Anniversary. Yeah, that's what I meant. Her and her husband have the same birthday? <laughs> no, no. They, they, they are celebrating an anniversary. Thanks. I'm glad you actually did something right there this morning. See, I tried this. I pay attention. 56th wedding anniversary. That's I believe Elva and I believe her husband's name is Cecil. So I want to wish them a happy anniversary coming up uh, tomorrow once again. And she said that this was the song that kind of brought them together. So I thought it'd be kind of neat to play for them this morning. You've never heard this. No, I haven't. And you didn't think I'd ever find it because it's a song that's been around for quite a while. Well, you've been around for quite a while too, Chris. <laughs> this so is I think you should dig it up somewhere. <laughs> from Carl Smith this morning. It's called Just Wait Till I Get You Alone.